Park Animal Shelter, and he's here today. It's Kool-Aid. Yes, he is looking for his forever family, and also with us to tell us all about him is volunteer coordinator Amy Buttram. Amy, welcome Hello. back. Hello. So he has been at heart for a while. Yes, he came in in 2019. Um, we got a call when back when we were animal control, said that there was an animal at large that was chasing cats. Uh oh. And could we come take a look? So <laughs> brought him in. Yep. He and brought, is a lover. Yes. Yeah, so we brought Coolidge in. Unfortunately, no one ever reclaimed him, and so he has been with us for four years. Wow. And that's yeah. a long time for a oh, dog. Oh yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. So when he came in, he was about three to four years old. Was estimated. So they estimate him about seven to eight so he's in that middle age to senior age um, but he is just an amazing guy uh, the only issue is because he has been with us for quite a while and we do know kind of some of his idiosyncrasies is that he is definitely going to need a really special home um, we would prefer someone that's, you know, pretty dog, knows a lot about dogs. Um, however, we also understand when you know a lot about dogs, you usually have a ton of dogs. Oh, um, and okay. he is going to be someone that's going to need just an only house. He can't have any other cats, can't have any other dogs, and just some place that they can understand that he needs to decompress for quite some time before Kaido. Of course, now he's just like, yeah, that's I don't good. Know. He's no. chilling right here. Right? With me. Yeah. I think he wants to yeah. come home with me. Uh, oh. Probably, probably. <laughs> well, and I have Chicken McNuggets in my pocket, and he's not even interested. Oh, so, wow. yeah. <laughs> Scratches <laughs> over treats. Oh, yes, yes, yes. But you know what? He is a wonderful boy, though. We've gone on several walks today. We walked all around your parking lot. He was nice. fine. We went to Tractor Supply in Hoopston today. He took his uh, took a bath. Um, okay. Yeah, so he has been great. And we had that picture up there of his toys. He actually, we implemented at all of our um, exterior places for the dogs to go outside. They now have a toy box so they can choose toys because of Coolidge because he loves his toys. Oh my goodness. Yes. Well, all those little beauty shots there. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna find him a home today, but mm -hmm. you've also got a fun fundraiser in the yes. works for February. Yes, absolutely. So this is a fundraiser I've been wanting to do for a while. Um, I'd heard about it through some different groups uh, that I follow online and thought we should do this. And just every time it's been around this February, because it's a one on you know the other side of Valentine's Day, um, <laughs> that we just needed to do it. So we are doing one that essentially is the lovely emoji, which I know you said you could not get up on the screen, but the little swirly emoji. Um, we can on say love. poop. Okay, we you can say, say poop. poop. Okay, good, yeah. good, good. Yeah. I'm never sure which word we can use, but anyway, so poop on love. There's only so, about four words we can't use. <laughs> okay, good poop to know. One of them. Okay, good. So what it is is I have over 130 cats that are ready to do some business for you. So if you have had some possible bitterness in your life, some heartbreak, and you really just want to show it to your ex, well, not show it because, you know, libel and slander, we don't want to get there. Um, <laughs> but what it is is that you can buy a spot in a litter box for $5. You can buy four spots for 18 and I think I said a whole litter box for $25. i will have to check my pricing. Oh, I think you said $30. 30, 30 okay, it. $30, 30 yes, yeah, sorry. I had to think of my pricing. So $30, and our cats will all go at it, and we will send the person that submitted the funds, we will send them a picture of of uh, what happened directly to them. So I'm not gonna send it to your ex. And I should note that all of the names, all of these men are innocent that are listed there. One was a grouping of Taylor Swift's exes per Google. And the other one was all the people that Elizabeth Taylor was once married to. Oh my so God. So we tried oh, to so keep it. Alone. You got a good list of Right, exactly, there. exactly. So I was like, man, there's no, no chance of being upset about anything. Yeah. So yeah, so it's really gonna be a fun fundraiser. Um, we're doing this through, I believe, February 12th. We'll be collecting the funds. And then I'll be working with probably my team volunteers to get some names written down and get those into litter boxes and then through Let that the next cats do their job. Exactly. And through that next weekend, like I said, we'll be sending you pictures. So keep an eye out on our social media as we promote it more often to get more information on where to send the funds, how to send it in and what to send in. So yeah. Very good. I Such love it. Super creative. Yes, yes. A unique way to celebrate those um those that got away. Right, so, right. Well, hopefully Coolidge is going to go to a great home. Thank you so much for introducing Absolutely. us. Such a little lover over here. You he was, is amazing. Yes, and if you want to learn more about adopting Coolidge or participating in that Poop on Love fundraiser, <laughs> head to CIliving.tv.